I was born in Telo Intan, uh, which was previously known as Telo Ensign. Um, that was in 1957. Well, I've uh, gone back, uh, but not for the last uh, maybe 10 years, no. Uh, it certainly looks like a very long journey from here to there. I wouldn't say it has changed a lot. Um, it, it cannot be... It has changed, yes, certainly. Uh, I was told that the Parag River is getting wider and wider. That's all. But uh, otherwise, I, I wouldn't say there's any development there. But this is based on the, uh, like I said, you know, 10 years ago. Went to Standard 1 up to standard 6 in uh, anglo Chinese school uh, in Tulentan. From the time I was born, so you, you actually really start off coming out of the house maybe when you are like 5-6 years old. Until then you are like kept in the house. Uh, my dad was a, my late dad was a very strict man. So we cannot mix with neighbours freely. Yeah, it's Home, school, home. What, what happens is, when he's not at home, then my mother gives us a little bit of, my late mother, uh, gives us a little bit of uh, leeway. So then we tend to go out and have some fun. Uh, and, and when I say have some fun, is, is either we fly kites, or play marbles, top, this is a small one, where you just spin with a thin string. Yeah. This kind of activities, we did not have any computers then. Yeah. No internet. Malaysian. I wouldn't say anything in particular, because the first issue that I had, eating nasi lemak and landing myself, full, my whole body was full of rashes. So, there goes man, <laughs> my favourite food or whatever. Uh, my dad wanted to relocate all of us. Uh, we had a sister who was married and living in Klein. My brothers were slowly moving one by one, getting a job in, uh, in, in Slango. And then came the time I had to move up. I I don't know, but maybe at that time I would have felt bad that I'm leaving my hometown. Um, but today, uh, it's a very nice place to stay. Peace, quiet, yes. Hi, my name is Thiago Rajan Wetelingam. I was born in 1957.